Hi, my name is May, and I actually had my surgery with Dr. Chin about three years ago, 2019, um, and I've just come in for a checkup. I'm extremely pleased. I, prior to surgery, um, was legally blind. Um, I also was um, had historical reason uh, to believe that I would keloid easily, um, and then also I'm dark pigmented as well so these are all factors that increase uh, the probability of scarring and therefore makes it you know more difficult or challenging to actually have corrective eye surgery um, and so at the moment uh, three years post-surgery I'm actually better than 2020 I'm 2015 um, and I'm just really pleased and want to be able to share with other people that might have similar attributes to myself in terms of um, you might scar easily um, and develop keloids or perhaps um, you're way over um, in terms of being legally blind um, that there is a possibility and there are solutions uh, Dr. Chin used a technique in a research paper he published about 10 years ago um, that allows them to basically mix a special solution called MMC. Um, they're able to do it precisely in a way that it's at the right level of concentrations, etc. It's not something a lot of doctors want to touch because if you do it incorrectly, you can obviously create a situation with the eye um, and actually make things worse. So they've developed this technique through research um, using this special solution that's actually able to help um, with the process to ensure that you don't scar as well. And hundreds of patients in this uh, um, center have done it prior to myself um, that I was able to also speak to once they gave their permission for that to happen. So I'm just really pleased. I think it's really important for two reasons. One, um, for other people that might have susceptibility to those factors I mentioned, there is a solution. And secondly, Dr. Sheen is going to be retiring soon. Um, and I think he's really keen on sharing his insight and his research with other doctors as well. So more people are able to understand that it is possible to address uh, vision issues with people um, that do have a tendency to scar easily uh, post-surgery and there is a solution for you out there. So yeah, I hope you look into it further.